Hey guys, welcome to another video. Sorry about that. So, welcome to a brand new video. Uh, we're going to be reviewing Ian Dior's I'm Gone album, which I haven't been anticipating. I, I don't guess. I don't listen to Ian Dior, so I mean, it's my first experience besides that one song he sang with Gunna. Besides that, I have no experience. So let's get into the first song, I guess. Paradise by Ian Dior. <laughs> I like it. And I got a talent. The beat's nice, I like it. It's a shorter song, too. His voice kind of sounds nice. It kind of sounds weird, though. Sounds kind of like out of place. Well, I mean, besides that, I like it, I guess. Um, shorter song, too. Perfect length. If it would have went on for a second verse, probably would have dragged a little bit. But, let's get into the next song. Pretty Girls by Ian Dior. I don't know why I said by Ian Dior. Y'all know it's Ian Dior. It's his album. My time, hundred missed calls, you cry. Why you always hit my line with the same old line? Pretty girls wanna have fun, get drunk, get fucked up. Why you hit my line? I was talking about the same shit, wasting my time. Trying to think that you were brainless, one of a kind is what you had me thinking you were out of my mind. And the truth hurts me down, so I can't lie. It's been better with you out my life. Got a pain on mine, cause every time I think of It's not my type of song, but it does sound nice. If I could come at the scene song, hook, verse, hook. I like the beat. Short song again. I, I, it's okay, I guess. Not my type of song, but I mean, I like it. It's okay. Next song. Sickness. 
One third of the album, it's only nine songs. I like this one a lot. Ooh, this sounds nice. I just saw it's a lot more and it's like a big glob of light. I like that one a lot, simply because it had my type of sound, and I just liked it. Sounded nice, beat was good, he sounded, he sounded nice, but shorter song, well, never mind, it's two and a half, two and a half minutes, so not really shorter. This one's shorter, though. Shameless. I think this may have been a single, but I haven't heard it, but... Sounds interesting. I live a rock star lifestyle. Always can't wait to get Betty in my mansion. Ask her how she wanna play. Lay a proper like a track on county California faces. Looking back, it's crazy now. Damn, I really made it. Doing too much. Shut up. I kind of like it. Light as crap, though. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. It sounds nice. Again, a really quick song. Really short, but still good. Next songy song song is gonna be Psycho. This one's short too. Can you speak my language? Add it up, add it up, add it up. Nigga women walk the hallway. Life get twisted when you're famous. She gon' drive me psycho. If I give her one more chance, and that's something I know. With the devil, I'm a dance. No, this bitch had a fuck. Whoa. Huh. B. The beat went. Wow. Beat had a bit of a seizure right there. 
Still is. <laughs> I like it though, I like it. Bro, this beats all over the place. Okay, I wonder what that was there for. I wonder if that's meant to signify something. Probably ain't, but, you know. Alright, I just want to consider... I want to look at something. This is probably... He... I think... At least this is what he did last year. He had two albums last year. I think... My dude is doing what he's going to do. What, what he did last year. Had an album in the middle of the year, and then he had an album at the end of the year. That's probably what he's doing. Because his first album of the year last year was shorter with eight songs then his next album at the end of the year had 15 so i think he's gonna do another one this year with like 15 songs like i said i'm a genius i know next song sick and tired featuring machine gun kelly and travis barker some big names Ooh. Ooh, I hope they go back to back. That'd be nice. Bit of a rock song. Tool of the first yawn. <laughs> first yawn of the video already. Where's Travis Barker? I want to I want to hear Travis Barker. I like it. I like MGK on this. Sounds nice. So that was basically Ian Dior featuring Machine Gun Kelly. I don't know. Uh, I mean, I've ne I've actually never heard a Travis Barker song, which is kind of why I was curious to hear him. So if he if he was obviously on that song and I just didn't know about it, can you please tell me? Because I I want to feel I kind of want to feel retarded. 
So, next song, second to, actually not second to last, technically. I mean, the very last song was a single, which I guess I listened to anyway, because I haven't heard it. It does have a little baby in it, though. This song, though, third to last, is Runaway Kid. If a song does get boring though, you know what I whipped out? Yeah, boy, got the Pokemon cards. Hasn't got boring yet though, so I'm just gonna keep counting them. Wow, my Funko Pop really just fell down right now, didn't it? I'm gonna look at something real quick. Wait. It was a good song. I liked it, but I'll be right back. Okay, your boy can't find it, but there was like a, I used to have like a wallet whenever I was little. I had like a bunch of fake money and I'd throw it, which is what I was trying to do. I was trying to find it, but I can't find it. So your boy can't do that, but I can't go to the next song. Good day. Second to last song. Why does my Funko Pop keep falling? Whoa, whoa, he's white, he can't say that. He can't tell me he's mixed. He he looks very white. He can't say that N word. He can't say that. He said it again. He's pulling an ass. Second yawn.
It's a vibe, I like it. It's a good vibe, I like it. It's okay. I think I've liked every single song so far. So, that's how you know it's a decent album whenever you like every single song. So, next song is a bit of a chunky boy. It's almost four minutes. Prospect, featuring Lil Baby. Ooh, I like that. Kind of Chinese feel, Chinese vibe. Ooh, I like that. This is more of my sound. Oh, I like this a lot. That kind of hurts. I like this a lot. <laughs> that felt good. Little baby better go hard on this. I like this. I like him on it. I like little baby. I like little baby on this. I was feeling that a lot. Yeah, he definitely put the best song on the last track. This was a single, though. I'm kind of mad I didn't listen to this earlier. This, I love this. This is amazing. I like that song a lot. That bumps, that bumps this album up to, like, like a solid, um, eight, no, I'm going to say seven out of ten. Let's see. A lot of takeaways are Shameless was good. Sick and Tired was good. Good Day was good and Prospect was good. So about half the songs. But I mean, there's no bad song. There's only like, they're all good. It's just there's like definitely more that's better than others. I'd give this a 7 out of 10. I like it. Definitely wants me to listen to more Ian Dior. So I guess that's it guys. Probably next video I'll probably review like a bunch of singles that came out. 
I ain't reviewing J. Cole's out song because I don't I don't want to get into that topic. At least yet. I mean, I may make a video on it, but like I just don't want to get into the topic. So a song like that I want to listen to and fully encapsulate. I don't know if that's a word, but um, listen to in like full full thought. I don't really. Because, I mean, if I did review it, it'd kind of just me be, like, saying, like, stuff after, like, so long. Just be me saying, like, just, just listening to it for, like, five minutes. So, I'm not going to do that. And I'd be talking about the topic for, like, ten minutes on its own. So, like, it's 15 minutes on just one song. So, I'm not going to talk about that. Won't review it. Unless y'all, like, beg me to, then I won't. 